Cigars and hymnals. We open tonight with a church and a proposed cigar lounge in the same neighborhood. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brad Berg. And I'm Shelley Kirk. Evansville City Council approves the next step in one woman's plan to open a cigar lounge. But there are some concerns about location from her future neighbors. Eyewitness News' Katie Forcade brings us the story. On Washington Avenue sits a small building. Stephanie Fleming is looking to officially open up Flem Smokehouse in this space, a private cigar lounge for members 30 and older. And just try to provide a safe haven where you can just come relax, watch TV, hang out with your friends or family. Um, so that's what we're basically planning on doing. Fleming and her legal representatives went before City Council Monday night to discuss a rezoning ordinance, and they were met with some concerns from operations already on the street. But I'm really concerned about the children in the neighborhood. Her business would open up right across the street from a church, and there's also a learning center and daycare center. Keeping it classy is what they were saying that they had planned to do. Um, and so if they can do that, I guess I can just mind my business and hopefully that doesn't interfere with the families that I serve and they won't decide to take their children elsewhere. Fleming says she understands the concerns that were presented at the council meeting. She says there will not be large crowds allowed to gather at her business. We really stress on being safe, a safe environment and stuff. And so it's ultimately up, a, up to us to making it a safe environment for everyone. Council passed Fleming's zoning request. Now, she has to get other proper licensing with plans of opening officially in the next month or two. We're here, you know, if they ever need any help or anything. And, you know, I'm hoping and praying that we can get to the point where we can all work together. In Evansville, Katie Forcade, Eyewitness News.